Welcome to Dallas. Today I'm going to show you some of the best restaurants and bars here in this incredible Texan city. Let's begin. Beto and Son in Dallas, and they have the best modern Mexican here. They also serve really unique drinks that have won tons of awards and have been on Travel Channel, served by Chef Julian, who has won the 30 Under 30 Zagat Award. So this is a place that you absolutely want to check out. This is a really cool drink they have here. It's a rosé pineapple with absolute elix. They also have a liquid nitrogen margarita and tater tot nachos. So some really unique combinations here in Dallas. We're gonna go check out their food. I'm really hungry, I'm really excited. Let's go eat some delicious Mexican. As much as we can do in front of you I, and still operate as a restaurant, you know, like we're doing our best to just do everything right in front of you. Just so you can see, like, these are the ingredients, this is how they look, this is where they come from, you know, and really make it, uh, you know, something that you guys can appreciate. You know, wanting to care about where your food comes from, where it's sourced, you know, who it's bought from, so, you know, that's what we're all about. Add to the experience. <laughs> in my opinion, the best margaritas are the ones that are made just pure lime juice, agave, orange liqueur and tequila, just the good stuff. Tequila and orange liqueur. Some of the behind the tequila in this one, I actually went to Mexico uh, with Avion tequila, that's the tequila we use for this. I picked out uh, the exact agaves I wanted, uh, how long I wanted them to be aged, and uh, all of those things to make sure that in this particular drink it was the best. Completely liquid. So now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna freeze it. More experiential. Uh, this drink was actually on uh, the Travel Channel. Uh, it got us one of the best Mexican bars in the United States. Uh, we were featured as one of the top bars uh, in Dallas as a Mexican restaurant. We're not even a bar. Oh, uh, oh my gosh. Pretty crazy, right? This is the coolest thing I've seen. Well, that's not true. There's, the food's amazing. But they give you a blanket when you're cold here. Do you know how much of a game changer that is? So many restaurants should do this and they don't. So I'm like super happy right now. We have a choco flan. Yes. Oh my god. House made choco. Truth and Alibi. This is a really cool speakeasy here in Dallas. It looks like a candy shop on the outside, but on the inside there's a bar. That's what a speakeasy is, by the way, if you've never been to a speakeasy. They're really cool. So this one, you have to have a password to get in. You can check it out on their Facebook page. They change it uh, weekly and sometimes daily, honestly, it looks like. Tonight's password is Hershey's, so let's go try to get in. I'm here at the Tipsy Alchemist, one of the best bars here in Dallas. And 
you have a really interesting backstory. Can you tell me a little bit about it? What is it that makes you so amazing at making these <laughs> great cocktails here? Well, I guess it's really just passion. We've teamed up with a few people here that are excellent home chefs, from Master Chef all the way to myself being a part of one of the largest gin bars in the West Coast. So we brought all that out here to Dallas. So you made this really good one. So what this is, is called the Samba. Delicious. Three of those and you're dancing around the room. You lit this on fire. So we have a toasted lemon wedge with a tahini, which is a chili and lime salt uh, on the outside. The cocktail is made with freshly juiced ginger. Uh, we have lemon, honey, and cinnamon reduction in there, as well as mezcal and a dash of cayenne pepper. I love all that multi-dimensional flavor here. Sweet, smoky, spicy, and tart. Okay, you get it all here at the Tipsy Alchemist, so make sure you check this place out when you come here in Dallas. It's amazing. So he built this whole glass up setup. So this is a stemless martini bowl. They just have like the actual, you know, the stemless glass. It sits in an ice bath. These are repurposed salt shakers from Hobby Lobby. Whoa. Like a bomb, you know? Oh my god. <laughs> When I shake it, it will blow up almost, you know? Really? Pressure, it pressurizes once you lock the tin. For the majority of people who come in here, we have our full menu that gives everybody the option to order just about every spectrum of cocktail possible, but if something doesn't stand out to that specific guest, they're more than willing to tell us a profile that they're looking for. So we meet across the bar, I just need to get two cents to make my whole dollar kind of thing, you know? And once I get the two cents, the dollar comes like that. I am so amazed right now what they use to mix their drinks here. They put it in a little bottle, then put it in a tube, shoot it through here. It's what banks use to send checks or mail around. I've never seen a bar anywhere in the world that shakes their drinks like this. So this is just, wow. What a unique place here in Dallas. I'm amazed. Good for you guys. Round of applause. <laughs> Of their famous dishes. We just got our food. This is the Normandy. It's French toast stuffed with cream cheese and raspberry jam. Sourdough French toast. So delicious. Look at this delicious mess. Oh my god. And what I got, which is one of their signature dishes, is jalapeno bacon and cheddar waffles. This is drizzled with maple syrup and gravy. It's delicious. <laughs> parts of Mexican food, so I'm really excited to try it tonight. Do you like my car? <laughs>
And those are the best restaurants and bars here in Dallas. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, remember to subscribe to my channel, follow me on Instagram, and I will see you next time.